Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the most FPS out of your PC. And guys, before the video starts, I just want to say that there is 90% of you guys that aren't subscribed. So I'd really appreciate if you guys could leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you guys comment if this worked for you. But without further ado, let's get into the video. So guys, depending on what kind of GPU you guys have, some of these might not work for you, but some of them are going to work for you. Um, like for instance, if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, then this is all these steps in here are going to work for you guys. And it's going to raise your FPS by a ton. Like for instance, if you have a 2080 and a, or a 3090, some of these might not do anything, but you will see a little bit of, you know, a little bit of FPS boost, but not that much because your graphics card is a pretty good graphics card. So anyway, guys, let's get in on how to get 1000 FPS or more. One more thing, guys, I do not make a dime off my montages, so I'd really appreciate if you guys could leave a like and subscribe on this video. It actually helps me out more than you guys think. So, now, let's actually get into the video, guys. Okay, guys, so first the thing you want to do is you want to go down to your search bar, and you want to type in game mode. And as you see, it comes up with game mode settings, and you want to turn that on. What game mode does, it basically optimizes your computer just for just playing video games but don't worry guys you don't have to turn it off every time you're not playing a game if you're doing homework you can keep it on but like it just makes your fps go higher and it makes your game more steadier all right guys the next thing you want to do is that you want to go down to the search bar and you want to type in background apps and as you can see it comes up like this what background apps is it basically runs everything in the background while you're playing games which obviously that's gonna lower your fps it's kind of like startup but this runs while you're playing startup is just when you load up your computer but startup does make your fps go down more but this when you turn this off will have a huge difference on your fps your fps will increase by like probably like 20 to 30 fps depending on what computer you have so guys to turn these off just hit this that turns them all on make sure you have them off um so guys let's get into the next step all right, now you want to go back to your um, search bar and you want to type in startup and see here it says startup apps. You want to click on this and this right here. This is what you can turn on and off. Obviously, I have mostly everything off because when you load up your computer, guys, all these are running in the background. So most of these running you want to turn off. I mean, if you have like a razor mouse or a mouse program, you want to keep that on so your lighting works on it. Or if you don't have any lights, then just probably turn it off. But like Epic Games Launcher, turn that off. Just turn most of them all off, guys. But that's not my choice. For what you guys have to turn off, you can turn off whatever you guys want. Now I want you to go into Fortnite and turn every single setting on low. Because that is comp settings. And guys, if you don't know what comp setting is, it just makes your PC do everything mostly for end game. Mid game, it doesn't really matter. But end game, when there's a lot of people around you, you guys want the most FPS you can get. Because some PCs can go to 70 FPS. Mine goes to like around 80 when I'm playing a scrim end game. And it's just awful. And guys, turn your FPS off while you play games because it doesn't give you that much of a increase in your FPS, but it does a little bit. And you just get demoti demotivated when you look at it, and it's just so like bad FPS. I mean, at least I do. If you guys don't keep it on, it doesn't matter to me. It matters to you guys. I'm just trying to help you guys out. And guys, don't play with anything else in the background except this app. I'm going to tell you. I'm gonna have the link in the description that it makes your FPS like steady and it makes your input delay actually less i'm gonna have another video coming out on input delay too i'm gonna start posting videos like this because i don't know i like to help my subs and all that so make sure you guys subscribe you'll get a ton of new videos coming out like this and turn on no, no post notifications because i promise you guys you guys don't want to miss these videos all right guys now you want to head over to your search browser and you want to type in timer resolution download and guys what this does it makes your input delay and your fps boost a little bit your input delay is going to be lower though and it's going to feel really weird if you use it and then don't use it so i would always keep this running while you play fortnite all right guys i'm gonna have the link in the description just click on the link in the description hit free download guys this is a safe site trust me pro players use this it's not it doesn't I'll, it doesn't have any viruses or anything guys so just trust me on this one hit free download right here i already have it so i'm not going to do it but then it's going to look something like this it's gonna look a little something like this and what you guys want to do you just want to hit maximum then um hit the little arrow in the top and just minimize it and then just play fortnite and then you guys are fine and then your fps will be steady this is as much as your fps is gonna get in fortnite 
in other games actually too guys you can run timer resolution so it doesn't really matter and guys i'm gonna have more videos coming out like this this is unfortunately the end of the video guys but if you guys did like the video make sure you guys leave a like subscribe because i'm gonna have a ton of new content coming out if you guys don't know me i post highlight videos i post montages i'm working on my editing i'm trying to get more montages like flea and milliam i'm trying to work on montages like that guys join my discord server it's gonna be the first link in the description my instagram is in there too go follow me it's doggo.yt but guys i hope this helped you leave a comment if this helped you and tell me more video ideas i can do for you guys but anyway guys i hope this guys really helped you i hope you guys enjoyed the video and yeah see ya